Good afternoon. My name is Chris Mitchell. I work within the Honors Program. I run two programs. One program called AIMS. It's the acronym for Academic Investment Math and Science. And also I run a program called CURS, Center for Undergrad Research and Scholarship. My involvement with the AIMS program, as I said before, stands for Academic Investment Math and Science. Uh, it is completely uh, concerned about students that are interested in the disciplines in STEM, science, technology, engineering, mathematics. I, I assist in the recruitment aspects of it from going uh, all the way out to Columbus, Cincinnati, Detroit, Cleveland, and of course Indiana. I'm also uh, over the seminar, I teach a seminar class as well for our AIM students. We uh, currently have over 60 students in our program and we bring in each cohort each year between 20 and 25 students per cohort. Pretty small cohort because we want a very warm and friendly uh, feel. When there's too many students, it gets somewhat tough. Uh, every, the whole experience kind of gets tainted uh, because there's not that one-on-one -on -one that students really truly enjoy. We I like to assist, to assist them when it comes to seeing them make that transition from high school to the university setting. Uh, and, and we're excited about that. We can, we can be a huge part in that whole development, in that transition period. I would definitely say uh, for the student that's the incoming freshman to uh, make sure they have a conversation with their guidance counselor. That they can put together a strategic plan that will help guide them when they make that transition from high school to the university setting. Extremely imperative that they take their, their uh, ACT prep extremely seriously uh, because that's going to be like the great indicator of where they're placed uh, in regards to scholarships, in regards to different things of that nature. And so uh, the HT prep is extremely important. Of course the GPA, the cumulative GPA is extremely important as well. And so taking that stuff serious, there's nothing wrong with asking questions. I don't believe in stupid questions. I think all questions are very valid, especially if they're referring to your, your growth and development when it's time to make that transition to the university setting. And also truly feel uh, that you need to get yourself involved in, career, uh, in, in regards to uh, services, uh, a service project that also looks very good on your resume and your visa when it's time to go to, to come to college. If you're also involved in sports, that looks good too. Thank you.